boarding school is kind of like having a second home, having a second family because the house that you get put into just kind of becomes your home. You have a roommate, you have friends, you're down the hall from your friends. It's just kind of everything's there. Uh, what boarding means to me, it's definitely not what I thought it was before I came to Brentwood. It's not uh, you're being sent somewhere where you're just going to have the worst time of your life. No, I actually really enjoy boarding here at Brentwood, just getting to be around some of the best people I've ever met, like day to day, living with them, having to essentially become my family. It's, uh, it's a very uh, uh, experience I would definitely love to be a part of. What drives the boarding culture at the school is, is the students. Um, Undoubtedly. Uh, underpinning that though is uh, an understanding of, uh, of the school culture and I, I think the school culture uh, more than anything else has to be based and is based on respectful relationships, um, accepting that there are clear guidelines that uh, all of us as a community need to follow. So integrity, honesty, forthrightness, uh, you, know, you know, mental toughness or grit. Um, uh, you know, being uh, humble, humility is huge and, and I think our kids understand that when we get into that framework and they become a part of it, it becomes important to them. So I think what makes Brentwood special from a Brentwood perspective is uh, a question that Clayton Johnson asks in the admissions process and that question without parents in the room is to the student sitting in front of them, do, do you really want to be at Brentwood? Because if you want to be at Brentwood, we'd love to have you. That question creates immediate buy-in on the part of the students. And it's not a parent-generated response, it's a student-generated response. And uh, it's the first step in learning how to work within this environment, how to trust the environment, how to start developing relationships with their teachers and their peers that evolves into uh, just an outstanding result for the young men and women that come to the school and then ultimately graduate and move on to the next steps. Choosing to be here uh, allows for a very positive culture around the school, so everyone is, in, is happy to be here, they enjoy being here, and when we come back from breaks everyone is really happy to see each other, and it's just, it's way easier to have uh, more friends around the house because no one's sort of down all the time or negative, and yeah, it just makes it happier all around. Well, I come from a really isolated island, and so my favorite part of living on campus is just how easily accessible everything is, and everything's right at your fingertips, whether it's, uh, you know, your the, all of the facilities are right there, but on top of that, it's a lot of the staff and all of your friends are all around, so everything's really accessible, which is something that I didn't really have at home. Personally, like, the first thing I noticed was that, like, the people want to be here and I think that's part of the reason that makes Brentwood special is that it's not just a high school of people living in the same area but it's people who have chosen to board and go outside of their comfort limits and it is a bar I would say boarding is outside of everyone's comfort limits but you're with a group of people that have all chosen that and I think that's really helpful from in the classroom you know everyone paying attention and everyone really wanting to learn because they've picked this class or on the sports field everyone's super engaged or in arts and it's just being around a great group of people to begin with but a group of people that really have the same values of you and have like the same direction as you is really nice.